I wonder if they'll ever realize I'm not Desert Claw. Jester. Uh, Raoul, what are you doing here? Thought you could just leave without saying anything? I'm sorry. I didn't want you to try to stop me. Me? Stop you? I... I want to leave this planet and travel through space. I want to see new things and learn about this vast galaxy we live in. It's been my dream since I was little. Come on, Raoul. What do you say? <sighs> I'm sorry, Raoul. Thank you so much for raising me and taking care of me. Well, I'm off. Wait. I always knew this day would come. Do you remember when you were just a boy? We'd always look up at the stars together. Yeah. Of course I remember. We'd gaze up at the stars and talk about outer space. up my mind. I want to go into space one day. Really? And what would you do out there? Huh? Well, um, I don't know. I don't know, but I still want to go, for sure. Can I, Raul? Huh? Can I? Of course you can, Jaster. You can do anything you want. Uh-huh. Right now, your eyes are shining just like they were back then. Self-assured, straightforward eyes. I don't think I could stop you if I tried.
go, Jester. But I want you to remember something. You're the only family I've got. From the moment I first held you, a crying little baby, 17 years ago, I've come to think of you as my son. And that, my boy, will never, ever change. Raul. I'll be waiting here for your return. I'm sure it'll be a little lonely. Raul. Someday, I'm gonna save everyone on this planet. I can't let Rosa remain in slavery forever. Then I'll stay here, hoping and praying for your success. Take care of yourself, Jaster. ship, huh? And so comes the end of one long day. Come dawn, I'll be leaving this planet. Something up there is waiting for me. I can feel it. And that's why... I'm going into space. It's almost morning. Hey, Chester! Over here, big man! Hey! Whoa! Uh, what gives? Uh, uh, uh. What the?
<laughs> that was a close one. <sighs> Who are you? Now that's what I call a close shave! Seeing monsters that big and ugly nearly sent me into a tailspin myself! We didn't mean to leave you out there like that. We fully intended to come back for you later, I swear. It doesn't matter. I got saved in the end. Listen, that girl back there... You mean Kasala? Wow, you sure don't waste any time. That's Desert Claw for you. Listen, though, don't you be getting any ideas, big man. To tell you the truth, she's... Hmm. So this is the guy. The legendary hunter, Desert Claw. Are you... Captain Dorgan Goa? Huh? <laughs> hey, Baldhead, set this kid straight. <gasps> Allow me to introduce Zegram Gart, the Black Wolf. He's a bounty hunter handpicked by our boss, like you. He's skilled all right, but he's got a big gob on him. Says he's a lone wolf. I think he just doesn't have any friends. I hate teaming up with small fries. Never expected Desert Claw to be such a youngster. Guess you can't trust rumors, can you? Hmm. <laughs> Anyway, nice to meet you, Desert Claw. Hey! So you're Desert Claw? Hmm. Wait, you're... The one and only First Mate Muncha! Uh... Is the captain still napping? Oh, he can be such a pain. Oh! The Desert Claw has a shrewd look about him. That's what the Captain would have said. I'm sure of it. When the Captain's not around, I'm the one in charge. And Desert Claw or not, you'd better follow orders. You got that? Uh... okay. Excellent! Now that that's out of the way, you're an official crew member on the Dorganok! All right, now that we have the legendary hunter Desert Claw on our side, nothing can stop us! The treasures of the universe are ours for the taking! I'm not sure. Maybe to some planet somewhere. Really? What do they have on other planets? Well, all sorts of things. Like what? What kind of things do you mean? I've never been myself, so I don't really know. Ah, oh, Raul, you're no fun. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. I happen to like this planet. As long as I can live here, I'll be satisfied. Really? Then I want to go into space. I want to explore the galaxy and see what it's like out there. Oh, really? I'm sure you will one day. 
Yep, and I bet it will be super cool. And when I come back, I'll tell you all about it, Raul. <laughs> well, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> Hmm. What's wrong? Uh, it's nothing. So, what do we do now? Oh, that's right, I forgot. Now we head for Zerard. Zerard? Goodness, haven't you heard of it? It's very advanced, the most civilized planet in the galaxy. So, why are we going there? We've got some important business there. Dorgan Ark? Full speed ahead! Aye aye! Your instructions will follow. Now I've got some lunch to eat, so if you'll excuse me, I'll be seeing you all later. Meow! You can take it easy too, Mr. Rogue. Perhaps you'd like to have a look around the ship while we're in transit. Good idea. I mean, after all, this place is your home now, isn't it? Mr. Rogue, what do you think? Huh, I like it. The Dorgan Ark may be a little old, but it's still the best in the galaxy. Whenever I leave the ship, I can't wait until we get back so I can take the helm again. The best in the galaxy. I like the sound of that. Very good. By the way, can I ask you something? Of course, what is it? Why is Dorgan Goa scouting out all of these great hunters? He must have something in mind. Well, um... Uh, maybe you'd better ask the captain yourself. It's not really my place to say. Yeah, I figured as much. I mean, Dorgan Goa is going so far as to scout hunters from all over the universe. But for what purpose? Say, we're about to pass through the Rose Nebula. Why don't you go up on deck and take a look? Best seat in town. I've opened the locks on the deck hatch. You can get there from the lower staircase. Got it. I'll check it out. <laughs> 